Welcome to Beer Stories from Beer Store Brewhouse. In this video, uh, this small experiment, I'm going to take a look at uh, how light affects the flavor of beer. If you like the video, please click like and sub subscribe down in the corner. Um, so I wanted to do this with Heineken because they are kind of famous for that skunky, uh, skunky flavor. Um, but I couldn't get any bottles, I could only get cans. So I settled on uh, Corona because it's a light crisp beer with not that much flavor in it. Uh, and I thought, well, that would be easy to detect if there was any flavor difference uh, when it has been out in the sun. A brown bottle actually protects the beer a bit more from the sun. So it, it had to be either a green or a, maybe a blue, but a, or a, a see-through bottle like this. So uh, yeah, that's why I settled on Corona. And um, this one stood out in the sun for two or three days. Uh, yeah, just outside. Uh, not hot, uh, it was still like 10 degrees Celsius at that time, so not much warmer than my fridge. This one has just been in my fridge the whole time. Um, yeah, it has the exact aroma of a Corona, there's not much aroma. Yeah, smells fine. Smells like almost nothing. Yeah, it's a typical Corona, um, like it should taste, so nothing wrong with that. Um, crisp, a little bit of malt flavor with you, if you really look for it, a little bit of sweetness from that, uh, yeah, from the maize and yeah, but not much flavor. Now for the suns, the one that's been out in the sun. Ah, oh, okay, that's really harsh. <laughs> if this is what a skunk smells like, I, I get it. <laughs> okay, that smells really, really bad. Like urine in the morning, kind of sweet, sharp smell. More sharp and sweet and more, I don't know, pungent. Oh. Okay, so this was, I can actually, I think it was three days in the sun. Okay, I'm going in. It tastes better than it smells. Ah, but it really tastes like Strong maize corn, uh, it's sweeter. Actually, it tastes kind of oxidized as well. But, uh, but it has this, um, yeah, skunky flavor. Uh, it's not, it's not mildew or yeah, oh, but maybe it is. That's really bad. Okay. Um, you can do this at home if you want to try or, or don't because I can assure you a couple of days in the sun that ruins the beer. Yeah, really fast, really bad. So keep your beers out of the sun. Um, I've heard people talk about a fridge uh, that does the same, uh, but I'm not sure because the UV light is not the same. Uh, in the fridge as the sunlight, so I'm not sure it would have the same effect. Um, but maybe next time I will let a beer s sit in my basement. Uh, there's often light in my basement, um, and then compare it to, yeah, to a normal beer. But there's no doubt that this beer is so ruined. Ah. Oh. It really, it smells like morning urine and kind of tastes like it as well, I think, but I haven't tasted morning urine, so I don't know. But it's bad. 
is really more bad than I actually thought it would be. So this experiment just shows that uh, no light, no sunlight for a beer anyway. Um, well, I guess that was it. Um, if yeah, if you like the video, please click like and subscribe. I would be really happy if you do. Um, yeah, and if you have any questions, uh, write them in the comments. If you have any ideas for a small experiment like this that you want to see, um, yeah, write them to me as well. And if you have any experience with any of these kind of experiments or just, yeah, something you discovered, write them in the comments. I really want to know. But uh, yeah, other than that, then just have a happy brewing out there.